So you gotta click apply changes twice. Make sure to click to apply changes twice. That's the smart thing. Let me turn the lights off. Make this more intimate. You know what's funny? I almost started typing Friday Night Frights when I was putting the title in for this game. I almost put Friday Night Frights in the Canarium. I was like, oh. Yeah, it's the wrong thing. Almost screwed up. It's hot. It's getting so hot. I need light. It's not a good noise. I feel like the game is really loud. Tell me if it's really loud. All life is only a set of pictures in the brain, among which All there decks. is no difference betwixt those born of real things and those born of inward dreamings. Good. Yes. Mm-hmm. I understand that quote. I'm very, I'm very, I'm very smart. Crush, do you, have you read any HP Lovecraft? I know you like reading. Am I in, oh, I'm in the video game. Pitch black. Twixt. But, tw <laughs> but wixt. <laughs> but twixt. <laughs> but wixt. Aw, oh, you should, it's really good. Shout over and this is really also mountains. Of ah, I can turn this down a little bit before I go deaf permanently. Permanent deafness. Don't hit escape. Don't do that. Do you hit escape? It resets all your settings. Don't hit escape. Uh, it doesn't it doesn't just reset? Okay, hitting. Okay, these settings are a bit fucked. Okay, just never mind. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm getting annoyed. It's annoying. Ooh. Those jellyfish underwater. At Mountains of Madness is also a good one. No more can we harbor ourselves. Safest shores will. There are things that cannot be undone. What'd you do, buddy? Did you mess with the old gods? You can't do that now. Doctor Flash. That never goes well. Is messing with you? the old gods. They don't like it. Why are my hands really big? Oh no. He's a monster. Oh. Got a weird clock hand. Got some some shit over there. Got doing a rave. Oh great. God damn it. Why is it I hate this shit. Yeah, this is based off of Mountains of Madness. At the Mountains of Madness. Buttcraft. I'm at last. The pain is subsiding. No, I don't do that. You can't see it right now, but when I look down, the taskbar pops up. Oh my god. This device. Its noises are resonating in my mind. Okay, now it fixed, okay. Base? I have this is my inventory? This train's vibe was already a left arm when I came around. Came, wait, on my left arm when I came around inside the meeting room of the Upat, Upiat Arte, Arctic base. I can read. It comes with no surprise that I don't remember anything about it. Some. Okay. E? F? 
click? Okay, so just, you just left click. Resonating in my mind. But spot but. This device. The noise is resonating in my mind. Resonating in my mind. Right. Empty notebook. That's the annoying sound button right there. Is that a bowl of sand? What is that supposed to be? Goop. Oh. Oh, I can't see shit. Still can't see shit. All right. What's that? What are, is this food you're eating? Is it you eating sludge, mud? What is that? Oh, doctor. Oh boy. This is okay, that's a, that's a transcript of this. All participants consume the Rush Devashe mixture five minutes ago when they entered some kind of altered state of consciousness, all of them now vaguely mumbling in their sleep. They are chatting something. The sounds are not con con conscious. They seem restless. I detected movement. Yeah, down limbs. He's always. I gotta be like a mad scientist or something. They wonder if it is because of something they actually sing me up. As always, the device is humming and glowing. But this time the atmosphere is different to the previous sessions. Whatever the reason for this might be, it feels almost like that fantastic device is signaling something in a code I don't recognize. It's becoming more and more stressful to be alone here in the midst of this cold, dim, incense-filled room. It sounds to me like the intensity of the subject mumbling to a much strong is much stronger now. Oop. Oh, I'll finish reading, so I got something to say. Colors and shades are dancing in the walls with the rhythmic ins and outs of the device. You can hear the wind howling inside. Maybe a snowstorm is approaching. Something even worse. Exactly five minutes and three seconds have passed now. They have drifted beyond my area of expertise and guidance. Cannot do anything further except wish for them safe return. Like, I read, like, out loud. I read better out loud when I do, like, a stupid voice. Or, like, an accent or a stupid voice or something. I do it I'm just reading in my normal voice. I don't know why. He's always been that way. Oh, I got a flashlight. Oh, yeah, flashlight. It's something. Oh, yeah, I found it. That's all I got. Dervashe. Or... Of Nightside and Beyond. Yeah, this takes place in Antarctica. Uh, uh, Mountains of Madness also take place in Antarctica. They done, they done fuck with the old gods. And the space bullshit. Hello? Anybody here? Never fuck with old gods. Where is everybody? Oh. oh. Looks like we're having a power problem right now. Got pictures. Oh, is that some bullshit? Oh, it sure is. That's some that's some Lovecraftian bullshit. Yeah, well, the Mountains of Madness took place, I think. 19, like 20s or 30s or something like that? I can't remember. Like back when they were first exploring Antarctica and shit. Took place. And I think this is like post. Post Mountains of Madness or something like that. Okay. The door doesn't like being touched. I like an amnesia where you can drag and open stuff. Makes it more immersive. Can't see totally squat. Oh, a note. Wait. There you go. Auxiliary power needs to be enabled. Manually come outside. 
Okie dokie. We can read all this stuff. But for Nikolai Henson, due date. Well, explanation is expected snowstorm. Snowstorm is expected to hit the next two weeks. It's the most important. Be all cautionary measures and don't don't die. And this one is a uh, engine crew member having problems sleeping. You might have somni or something. Jack off before you go to bed. I don't know. Be fine. Stop those bloody sessions. Somebody doesn't like the circle jerk session. Not a fan. Oh, fuck. Let's go back inside. That goes outside. I don't know how open this game is. There's something, though. We didn't read all these. Wrong storm, expected to hit, blah, blah, blah. Familiar visits the lower chambers once more, form of a black cat. Oh, familiar. Bitter image echoes through the seven rooms. What sin called it from those hollows, looming, dim, ghost-like. Familiar, so oh boy. Familiars are weird things. Fucking supernatural bullshit. Okay, I guess we're going outside. Oh, I have a flashlight, a torch. I mean, it's a torch. It's so stupid. They call them torches. Like, I keep hitting space. Number one trouble with just horror games. Can't see shit at all times. There's a, a strong light shining over there. Somehow it reminds me of a lighthouse. Oh, okay. It's easy to get lost in this weather. Okay. I had better stay close to the expedition base. Don't explore too hard. That's bad. Jump? No, I can't jump. What are my controls? What is my? This is my. C brings up my weird hand. Weird Bioshock hand. If you turn my light off. Oh. I turn the power on. Did I do it. Do we have power? I did it. That was weird. What is this? That was... This hose was tampered with. Oh shit. Cthulhu going around cutting our fucking generator hoses or whatever the fuck that is. Actually, Bounds of Madness is not about. Not really about Cthulhu, it's about some other bullshit. Oh. About madness. About staying the fuck away from Antarctica. The bullshit. That looks like it's something, but it's nothing, probably. I don't know what I accomplished. Can I turn the power on? 
is cloudy. And all I can remember is a successful establishment of the upper water Antarctic base. Well, audio keeps playing. Well, after that, when I pause the game, it keeps going. Night. Hold on. Turn down OBS a little bit. I'm thinking run. Well, run. Jog. Lightly. Some narcosis vibes from these games. I don't like it. I wonder if I can beat this in one sitting tonight. It's gonna be a long stream, maybe. Who knows? Not me. I didn't look up how long this game was. Maybe if I like it, I'll continue it later. Keep hitting space. Did I turn power back on? I don't know what I did. I flipped some switches and pulled a thing. Did I do it? I don't think power's back on. I don't think that did anything. Hmm. Locked. Hmm. Locked. Run real fast inside. Is there another building I'm missing? Already lost. Great. I'm loving it. But there's not some sort of timer for like how long you can be out here. Like the thing. Usually games do that. Did I not? Did I not? Uh oh. Wait, don't we need the hose? Wait. This hose was tampered with. I got. Oh, I gotta. This hose was. I gotta fix the hose. Oh, aha. Duct tape. Fixer of all things. That did it. Can't wait to Ryan duct tape for the power of the whole base. There you go. Spooked. I want to get spooked. I want a big spook happening. No spook for me. I want spooks. Oh, uh oh, there's the spoops. There's Zambi. That UHP left craft. What was that? It was not a scary man, a ghost. Camera, ow, the reflections. Oh my god. Expedition base. Apuat. Pequot, please come in. I repeat, this is Apuat Expedition Base. Pequot, do you hear me? <sighs> there is someone who can hear me. Please come in. 
No. Some electrical You're an Antarctica nerd. Air seems to prevent communication. On a walkie-talkie. Oh, I can't wait to chat with my, my bros in the sleepover. Do kids have sleepovers anymore? Is that still a thing? I remember sleepovers were super fucking coolest shit ever. So you get to have a sleepover like fucking yeah. Fuck our sleepover. I don't know. Kids today like they had a sleepover. They would just fucking like murder, go out in the night, and murder and raping people or something. This device, its noises are They're still a thing. I guess with the younger kids, I don't know. I don't, I don't trust kids today. They have too much access to the internet. Internet's evil. That's where I came from, I think. Okay, yams. Thank you. Thank you for that. That. That input. You eat Taco Bell, yams? <laughs> well, you have two. I guess they're. Imagine those friends that either their parents didn't care about them or they didn't like their parents, maybe. Or maybe they just do get no and give a shit. Is just right here. Where is he now? I don't want to guess what it's supposed like. Nikola Google the portrait. You will read this. Uh, Nick oh, okay. If his coat is just right here, where is he now? I don't know. People don't carry their coats with them everywhere, you weirdo. Locked. Locked. Oh, thank you for that description, Yams. It's locked. Yeah, that's what refried beans are. Ah, oh, sausages! <laughs> what are those? <laughs> no, they're like hot dogs. <laughs> little, little statuette thing. Little idol. I'm glad they are spiders. <laughs> they're fake Grammys. I think we're like hot dogs or something. <laughs> right here. Where is he now? Locked. Locked. Hmm. Locked. Hmm. Hmm. That's a lot. Mm. Private rooms. Oh my. It's so weird. My room is like so dark right now. Other than the TV, like the 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 border, I can't even see the borders of my TV anymore. It's locked. And it gives it like this weird like letterbox effect kind of, but there's not one. Cause like it's the black, the borders of my TV are blending in with my my wall. It's so dark. I can see the lock. Oh, it's locked. I can open this one now. What the fuck is this? It's stuck. Use Christmas lights to run your room. It just sounds like a, it sounds like just an excuse for laziness. Hidden plants of great antiquity. Oh my! I love that. Very nice. What is a socket wrench thing? I don't know what that is. Can I use it on this. Stuck. Oh, it's a handle. Handle for this. Oh boy. I turned on the... Oh. Is this the Cthulhu finder? Is this looking for Cthulhu? Am I trying to like line them up? I don't know what I'm doing. Oh boy. I don't know what I'm doing here. Oh, 
they look, they're going the same speed now. They're just not, there we go. They're just not lined up. I don't know what I'm going right now. You just found more Taco Bell in your fridge. I don't know what that is. What am I doing? I feel like I need to line these up. This is actually more. This is actually more visible on the OBS capture than this. Like, there's too much brightness here. I can tell better on the OBS capture. Okay, so I want. I could just drag that. I feel like I'm supposed to line them up. Not nah, going too fast. <laughs> You're not telling it twice in a row. Beep, 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 beep. I'm, this is confusing. And butt doing it. What do these do? I think I why so okay. Yeah, I can see it much better in OBS capture. Oh, that's really close. Now they're still over. Okay. Do I have to time it? Am I timing it? I'm not sure what I'm doing here. Just a distraction. Well, it's doing it for me. I feel like I need to do this unlock that thing though. Dang it! Like some of them are closer on each other than the other. Like some of them are on each other. Fuck this thing. I don't understand it. I can turn it. On. I guess I'm not turning it off. I wanted to open the Cthulhu machine. Oh, book. Oh! I can't read that shit. Wait. No. I could order a trophy item. I wasn't, I wanted to read that. Oh, look at that. You can, oh! Neat. Yeah, I'm stop eating that Taco Bell. I hear you eating it. Better find a crew member. That's what I, this is what I'm doing. I'm trying to find someone else right now. How do I? Well, I don't know how to find that book again, so I guess we're not reading that. I'm gonna try to get a like a transcript, but it was it was like no way, Jose. Can't take anything out of those. What's the point? Locked. Dang it! Did I lock my door? I don't, I don't remember recall my keys are. Frank Gilman. Oh, am I gonna be a fish man like an Innsmouth? I was the only one was open. This is where all the. Grammys were. This goes. What was that door? It was upstairs? Oh, this is in here. I was like, hey, 
Anybody home? Nobody was home. Oh, is that a map? It's some this some bullshit I don't understand. Hungry? Then go eat go eat Yams Taco Bell. Morse code. Oh, look, we can learn Morse code. Boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Did SOS. Boop, 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 boop. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna do some Morse code at you guys. Um, hold on. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. All right. I also Morse code. One of you guys decipher that. <laughs> Try this handle. I don't, know, I don't know what I'm doing. You got I'm that's it. We'll take a take a wild guess what the next part is. <laughs> so it was one more word. I go this way. Oh, I guess we're in the room. I couldn't. I, I messed up the last one. I messed up the last one a little bit, to be fair. It's locked. It's locked. Locked. There's an accent change there. Oh, it was I was I'm gay <laughs> in Morse code. Oh, I didn't go in here. That's a real picture. Uh oh These nightmares have become unbearable. I still see the same man in my nocturnal vision, but now he's holding something in his hand, which I believe to be a lotus flower. We seem to be continuing this grave and serious conversation again and again, but I still can't remember the content. During working hours, sometimes, I hear his voice through the radio. It's not a form of meaningful sentences, but more like some unconscious muttering. I'm afraid to tell anyone about this, for I hate the very idea of the suspension I will probably be facing. I didn't fuck that up too hard. I think I gotta I feel like since all these guys are British or whatever, I gotta be put on. Beep beep cheerio. Hello, Governor. What are you doing? Uh, Cthulhu. You having a, you having a giggle to do, dude? You wanna go, mate? Butterfly statue. And some goop. People love eating goop here. Some goggles. I love when Yams comes in my chat, tells me about his, his farts and poop, and then leaves. My favorite part of my day. Look forward to it every stream. Hey, who's this, Dean? Oh. More nerds. Look at that mustache. Look at those eyebrows. My goodness. Okay. Burb. Nothing. Nothing at all. No fin at all. Little nerd. Another nerd. Oh, those are real hands. A little scared. Oh, a key. For what? 
Johan de Witt. De Witt. There we go. This requires some searching. Find a key I need. But do I have to like use keys? What auto use keys? Imagine all auto use keys. Oh, here we go. Control trophy items. Dang it. Turn page. It's only one page. Scientifically, the pinnacle gland, also known as the pinnacle body, or a pineal. Wait, a pineal? 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 The pineal body. Panarium or epiphysis <laughs> cerebrae is a small interesting gland in the. Okay, it's too many big words for Belden. I'm gonna stop. Try not to sound more stupid than I am. I am that stupid, aren't I? You know, that key's not in any of these rooms. Locked. Locked. Those are the crew rooms. This was to... I don't know where I am. I'm extremely lost. Oh, no, I cast the... Wait. Oh, I have one in my room too. Oh, do I have to match the well, match? To match the one in my room? Maybe. It's uh. Can't see where the dial. Is. It's right there, and that one's like right. Okay, I can remember that. I have to match the one in my room. I don't know. That's the secret. Oh, I didn't go to the infirmary, did I? Oh boy. Very bright. Oh, I just need. Oh no. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, it went away. All right. Statement of consent. By signing a document, you, blah, 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 you can take my, my, my penis off or something. I don't know. Okay. I think I don't think I key open. That's probably what it told me. If it... More bullshit. Bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. What does that say? Upat Antarctic Expedition. Not an important book. Alright, let's go. It's stuck. Stuck. Locked. Oh, it smells awful in here. You're right, let's leave. I'm gonna go back to that thing before I can get it. Hold on a second. I'm so lost. Okay, this is the area with the thing. It was 
right there. That makes sense. This thing pisses me off. I don't fucking understand it. Fuck that thing. That running's weird. Where they serve the goop. They sure do love their goop. It won't open. Everything's fucking locked in this place. Super lost, god damn it. Elevator. Oh, there we go. Oh, we're going down. Awesome. Okay. Open sesame. Now we got some shit. It's stuck. We're down in the bullshit zone. No. You have a tree in your back. Fuck. Can't open that. Well, I went down an elevator. Well, that sounds good. Did you toast the bread? I hope. We got some bullshit in here. Yeah, sounds good. More bullshit. Also has bullshit. Auto save. Oh boy. save any time you can. That's cool. You can save any time. Neato. That's real fucking neato. What? Okay. 
button. You have to be able to interact with any button in this game. Some shit in there. game you got to pick up you got to start being interesting oh I started oh, some bullshit shock has it looks like I need something to get this elevator to work oh I got it Where's my handle? I had one, what happened to it? Did I use it on something? It's stuck. So I used it on, I don't remember using it. Maybe I can take it from the other elevator. It's stuck. It's stuck. I think that you do it a second time, he gets like fucking mad at you. It's like, God, oh, it's stuck. Oh, I didn't want to go out. Thought I had a lever thing, a handle. I'm gonna put on some now, so I don't remember. No memory. Locked. Did that close itself? Called Madison. Can't get in storage. Smelly room is useless. Can't get in there. It goes back out. It's already in here. The bullshit in here. Nope. Use the key, I don't think. It would tell me if I needed to get, use the key. I'll use the key in the locker. If his coat is just right here, where is he now? A note about a mental problem. Oh. <laughs> I've noticed a very curious and dangerous development in the psychological condition of the whole crew it compels me to record this note as an initial diagnosis report. Problem is especially intense for three subjects, Dr. Barlow, Dr. Anderson, and Frank Gilman, whom I have been inspecting closely since the onset of the psychological degradation. During the past two nights, the aforementioned subjects awoke screaming in their beds, thus affecting and demoralizing all the crew members. When I spoke to them personally, I noticed some serious devi deviations in their behavior pattern. As time progressed, I noted I noted deep changes in their mental condition. When really pushed, they clearly started to behave like someone else. Which led me to believe I was facing some sort of multiple personality disorder, but it is too early to draw any conclusions. Other subjects are not too far a cry from their normal personalities. The difference is, of course, obvious. Their conditioning is getting worse day by day, and a serious medical examination is needed to be carried out on every, everybody displaying such symptoms. I informed Dr. Faust and warned him about the consequences. He looked worried, but nevertheless hasn't mentioned it to me since. With the weather conditions we have been, we have been having lately, 
It seems extremely unlikely that we shall receive professional help from the outside world, or we'll be able to send anybody away from the thoroughly medical, well, away from a thorough. Ugh, damn it! It's the only sane thing to do under circumstances. Secrets. I don't know how that key helped me. very lost. Some electrical condition in the disturbed air seems to prevent communication. Interference, yes. Mr. Fucking Smarty Pants. Door went through me. That's outside. And there's anything more for me to do outside right now. There's only two buildings. The only thing I think of is this. Is there some sort of. There's another one of these in my room, but like I did the same positions and it didn't, it didn't do anything. I thought it might, I thought it might do something. It did not. I'm like sweating. It's extremely hot. I open the door. I could read. I mean, I, I skimmed through some things, but I doubt they had anything to do with this. But I, re I read everything. The only thing I can think of is I was just timing it. Just like I get it's that's the closest I can get it. I've gotten it closer, but like. Not sure if it's the thing that I'm doing it either though. Like the other one had it here and it had it there. That's obviously not it. Unless it is I'm not sure. Maybe that's it. Can't even interact with it. See it very well either. I don't, I don't know. Oh, maybe, oh, I didn't see these. What the fuck? Generated voice is out. What are the speakers? Incoming power needs to be regulated. Main feed input, backside. Auditory and visual data are fed to the main system of the primary filters. 
Is it really possible to feed the machines with an actual brain? Ancient sources speak to secretly about this, based on the writings of R. Bacon and Wolfgang von Kimpelen. I will try to improve the machine. Oh shit, okay. I'm fucking... I don't know if that helps me. Auditory visual data are fed. Main feed input, backside. Auditory visual data are fed to the main system by primary filters. Mean that? Incoming power needs to be regulated by the device on the loop. What the fuck am I looking at? 3.8 light equation. What are we set? There's light servo motors. Well, <laughs> after a haphazard momentary aerial exploration of the unholy, utterly alien cyclopean maze of square and curved angle blocks, we detect most of the locations revealed by the previous. This is not a special leisure, William Dyer. We're looking out there, according to various sources. Right on the edge of the mountain, beyond the mountains of madness, it was built over a location deeply shunned, even by the elder things, and built long before the colossal city. Outer Diner's team explored. Oh shit. Now here's the. Here's the. Now they're, they're straight up talking about the old ones. Oh shit. Now we set foot upon the lands no one has ever seen before. A vast mass of dry land around the South Pole, which rose from the primal waters when the old gods seeped down from the stars. A place so evil, most of the arcane sources hesitated to record it at all. While some murals within the Elder City depicted with obvious repugnance and trepidation. Okay, hey, that. Okay, I got it. I'm still not sure if it's what I, I gotta line them up. Are you got, I, I just gotta pick the right size. Maybe. Oh. I did it. That scared the shit out of me. Or I almost did it. Not oh okay, I got this one right. That scared the shit out of me though. Like that made me jump. a timing thing I got one right oh wait I'm about ten times the kinds of confused right now. Hey! I did it. Hey, James. I mean, Rickin. I did it. Oh, no! <laughs> Ew. Or oh, shit. This isn't too bad so far. Some HP Lovecraft shit. Oh, it died. Wake up! 
Wake up! What did that do? Is this a blowjob machine? This is the first blowjob machine. Hello, friend. Who are you? Oh. Uh, I'm I'm Frank. Frank Gilman. Is that so? Is there a problem with that? My name is Frank Gilman, an anthropologist joining this expedition upon the invitation by Venerable Dr. Faust himself. What? This thing is claiming that it's me. That's absurd. Why? Oh, God. I claim you're me. Uh, where is everybody? Where is everybody? They are here. Oh, thanks. What do you know about Dr. What Faust? Do you know about I don't need to Dr. say it. Faust. He is the grand mastermind and the pioneer of this expedition. Yeah, it really is. You're claiming that you are me, Frank Gilman. But you are just a machine. And you are just air. Oh shit. <laughs> I don't see anybody around. Are you sure? Yes. He got a vagina on his forehead. <laughs> Fucking sick burn. Okay, Frank. Tell me why are you here exactly? I am here because of my extensive knowledge on the human pineal gland. I am one of the canaronauts. I know. I know it. I know. No, what do you mean? I mean, what are you talking about? That's clearly a sideways vagina. <laughs> All right. New air. Air? What do you mean by that? It doesn't answer me. Okay, fuck you. Yeah, this game's been all about the fucking pineal gland. Pineal gland. Voyagers beyond. Beyond? Yeah, what some psychological beyond? shit. No answer. I found a secret. That, was a, that wasn't even a thing. I still don't know what to do. Okay, good night. You double as a blowjob machine? Oh god. Well, that was some bullshit. So it takes place after the Mountain's Men, it's after the crazy fucking ancient city was discovered. Yeah, there wasn't, I don't know if there was one in my room, there was a, there was a little beep boop thing. a secret was discovered. Like, what does it mean by a secret was discovered? Like, what the... What the heck? I can't touch mine. Mine's not connected to a weird thing. Yeah, I know. It's fucking super fast. <laughs> Makes me feel like I'm gonna have to run some room shit later. It's noises, so resonating in my mind this voice actor like he totally sounds like a fucking guy like doing English like an American doing English accent it, it sounds like it slips sometimes and you hear him talking because when he would go it's locked and the other time he's go it's locked Stuck. locked you're either locked I like I mean, he doesn't have a strong accent. Oh, 
Go back up the elevator. Did you see that uh that link I sent you, James, about the new Dragon Ball game? And there's been a couple of spooks. Uh there's um some weird statues fell out of a thing. And there was uh some weird ghosty things. I'm not sure where they were. Man, it's gonna be it's gonna be a two D, like two point five D, but it's it's not gonna be like the Tenkaichi style. Okay, so I need a for such security measures. Link elevator has been set up. You now reach both the tower and bottom levels below the base. Camp equipment parts for the portable submarines. First camp. I need the connector. Um, hmm. Tomorrow is a, a, a EA's press conference, by the way, at 3 p.m. Eastern. Um, James, you're Mountain Time or something like that. It says uh, 1 p.m., I think. You'll be up at 1 p.m.? I can't see shit. I can't have my light on. I keep forgetting flashlight. What the fuck was that? We got some shit over here. We got a, a map. What a weird map. Oh boy, I'm confused. I can't. I can't get it back. Okay. Australia, Antarctica. We're in. Oh. Whoa. Of ordering food, what right now? Peak, no. Oh, polar chart. Oh, hey, that's from the Voynich manuscript. These these pages right here. Wow, they just straight up took these from the Voynich man Voynich Voynich manuscript. If you guys do, you guys know about that the Voynich Voynich manuscript. I probably Voynich. I can't remember how to pronounce it. Something like this. It's um, it's a really old, really super old manuscript book thing from like the like the 1400s or like earlier or something like that. And it's like you can't. It's not like it hasn't been translated ever. Yeah, no one can read it. And these are these are pages. So I recognize these because I, I looked I looked it up and read all about it and look and uh, looked at the pictures of it. Look at the scans and stuff. They just straight up took. <laughs> I wonder if they realized like that's probably like an Easter egg. Like they had to have known people would recognize these. Wait, who just turned the light on? What the? It's cool though. Super neat. What is this? Ah! There's a problem with one of the freezers. I've labeled it. It must be checked immediately. Oh my god, kitty cat. Are you one of them there familiars I've been hearing all about? I like how I shine over there. It doesn't get a shadow. Boy, it gets a shadow here. And I don't I don't get a shadow. <laughs> new came established, waiting for new samples.
Yeah, Voynich Manuscript is super cool. That's like some real life HP Lovecraft shit. Fucking real life Necronomicon. Probably just some nerd back along, like the 1500s or whatever, is fucking bored. I'm gonna fuck with some future people. <laughs> It's probably it's probably the first D and D rule book. First troll. Oh no, they're trolls before that. It's stuck. Oh, I didn't find this before. No, yeah, I did. That's where. Wait, no, it's the elevator. I can't open. We would like to progress in this game because it hasn't been, it has stuff I like. I like the I like the old gods and I like the, the Voynich manuscripts and the crazy weird undeciphered freaky shit. What more? What is this What is this doing? What is this for? My ghost finder? Back down. Can I just take the handle? Be too easy, wouldn't it? It's stuck. Stuck. Link elevator. Yeah, that's the elevator I can't open. This is this room. I don't know about the origin of the canar canarium. Dr. Faust is very tight-lipped about how he came up with that strange exploration device he built long ago. The only thing he told me is that he came across some shunned and forbidden volumes about a vice of extraterrestrial origin. But again, all sources not hinted that at any exists on Earth, except in the dreams of those who like to chew a certain alka, alka, alkaloidal herb. <laughs> I can't read. This is where a sessions were held in the meeting room to adapt the nervous system. <laughs> the alien impulse of the machines were frightened at first. If used too much, it affects the body to breaking point. But now I'm used to it. It's non-human sensations. I've started to feel like the device is clearing my mind. Shut up! Clearing my mind to make it absorb much more than ever before. I feel un unconfined and much more receptive. The most peculiar aspect of sessions are because it is a shared experience. I am able to receive impressions, ideas, and even memories which belong to other participants. Usually my mind wanders after the session, and I cannot focus my thoughts until I slept for several hours. A strange device surely disorients feeling feelings and bodily functions, but I believe that is what it offers of immense importance. Personal Personal pepperoni, petrol cost pepperoni pizza. Oh boy. Have fun with that. Hello, kitty cat. Can you help me? Oh. Uh. Oh, this cat's some bullshit. It's making my hand go nuts. Oh no, it's in here. Locked. Thought it was a cat. Locked. You want you're not getting that? Let's leave. Oh, that's good. I don't. Is that Pizza Hut? Pizza Hut's personal pan, personal pan pizzas. Her little personal pizzas are pretty good. I like them. Locked. 
see if I can get my beeper going. Around here, maybe that'll help me. I, I had a handle in my inventory. I don't know what I... I guess it got used in something else. Stuck. I don't remember. I don't think I, I don't... I got it in the room with the weird head talking man. Outside. I doubt there's anything outside. I put it. I got it in here. I can't use it in here. Can you help me? Turn back on. Super lost. Double check all these drawers. Keep this out. Dumb butterfly thing. Oh my. That's a drawing. One of the com composite sculptures we come across during our initial field trip. It has an open third eye on its forehead as well as an inside its hand, which I think indicates some kind of state of knowing. Does illusions, knowledge. Wait. As this is. I'm, it's really dark. I can't. This is hard to read. I guess... Me, I'm blind. I'm some kind of stare, wait, state of knowing. His illusions and knowledge out of things recur all the time in almost every... All the time in almost every boss. Best relief we have discovered so far. All this leads me to believe these creatures inhabiting these halls acquire some kind of knowledge from the other things. Fable creatures of primal myth. Don't be fucking with old gods now. Oh, fuck me. Several other examples of the composite sculptures, ranging from humanoid to reptilian in shape. They are mostly damaged and generally in really bad shape. The lost parts were completed by the artist's imagination. You're a nerd, Sam Ben. Fuck you. Go to bed. Go to school. I mean, don't leave me. Please stay. Look at these crazy drawings. Yes, this is horror. It's uh, Lovecraftian. Mountains of Madness, Old Gods, bullshit. Abundance of five painted shapes seen in the design of the structure we've come across cannot be overlooked. In addition, most of the elegant figurines adorning and standing silently from most of the gigantic gateways are reptilian in shape. These look like some fucking Star Wars fucking creatures. Uh... It's been okay so far. I'm lost right now, but so far it's been fine. It's pretty slow, but it's not been it's not been horrible. I've played far worse. This grotesque masonry cause an uproar with the con I'm telling then con con I can't fucking I gotta put my glasses on, I can't read shit. Continents it wore on its reptilian face. When we first found it residing within almost substantial darkness of the cave where it had been carved in eons past, some of the crew even claimed that they had heard some muffled laughing sounds coming from within it. 
Behind Conan it was guarding uh, or hiding with its humanoid hands. It had some symbols carved to it, which we could get to decipher. What is that emote? We're going Oro, uh, Oroboro. Next. Oh. There's no next. The trophy. This is alright so far. But I need like a lever or something. I'm missing something. I solved the I solved the weird puzzle and it made me talk to a robot with a third eye. Okay, vagina. You're you're a cool story, Bob. Either one of these? Nope. You know, those like it's it's based it's actually like based directly after the Mountains of Madness, is what it's supposed to be. What I read the description, it's like it's based after the events of the Mountains of Madness, at the Mountains Lots. of Madness. It's not just general Lovecraftian. Which I like this base out with something more. I'm super lost. Here's the here's the robot. And he was like, You're air. I'm like, oh. I'm gosh dang. See you look. Cyclopean City, Mountains of Madness, Older City Ruins, all that bullshit. One of these talks about old gods and shit. This does. I think, I don't know, there's something here talking about old gods. I know we're close to what we have been looking for. Wait, I know we're close we have been looking for. During the adaptation session we have hold here in the wet meeting ruins, I feel a guidance of some sort, something pointing towards the destination we seek. This could mean we are now in sync with the ancient source. The wearable canarium we are carrying on our left arms connect and thus receiving sensations from the same ancient source. And sometimes I wonder whether this has been another soul during humanity's relative brief period of existence was able to achieve such a feat. From some shunned and elusive source I've gathered from around the world, it said the extraterrestrial species, the Elder Thang race, built it after passing through a stage of mechanized life on other planets. But its purpose remains clear. I don't really like the writing too much in this game. I don't know, like sometimes it's okay, and sometimes it gets to like I feel like I don't know. Like I don't feel like I'm reading like scientist notes half the time. Like it, it sounds like scientist notes at first, then it kind of drifts off into like land kind of just normal person writing I don't know it doesn't feel very old-timey sciencey writings or whatever yeah dr. Faust Just to, what? No. I had a lever before. I don't. I guess I used it on something else. Yeah. I opened this and all these. Oh, they're gone. What the hell? A bunch of these. I opened this. A bunch of these like flew out on the floor and they're gone now. Probably just the game couldn't handle them rolling around. Doubt it's like a oh spooky scary. I'm so fucking lost. Can I look at these. I guess I could go back outside. Stairs didn't have it. The radio room didn't have anything. Can my hand detect stuff? Outside. Hmm. 
feel like this game could get really interesting. Got some cool stuff. I'm very stuck. Big loss. No clue what I'm doing. I have to do a little bit of looking up. Yeah, it's not bad. I'm not against this. I like it. I'm just lost. I wish I wasn't lost. This shit. Did all this shit. Yeah, that'll happen. Boy niche. Very interesting. It stopped me last time I wanted to go this way. It's like, no way, Jose. You can't go this way. Now it's letting me go further. Let me go, wait, never mind. safe to go further away from the expedition base in this weather. Dang it. I need to look uh, at a walkthrough of some sort, maybe just real quick, find out what I need to grab. Okay, if James is still here, you can look it up. <laughs> no, it's fine. Radio room useless. This room. This device, its noises are resonating in my mind. I want a game based around, around the Voynich manuscript. <laughs> I wonder what they can do with that. I'm sure someone could write some fucking bullshit story, backstory of that shit. I already has a crazy story about it, but like, I want a, I want an origin story game of the Voynich manuscript. Just make it a Skyrim mod. Machine puzzles. I already did one. There's no other ones to do. Well, machine in my room. It wouldn't let me interact with it. I'm going back. Do it twice. Gosh, diddly dang. See if I can figure it out from here. I get lost in this fucking place though, super easily. Living quarters, dang it. This device, its noises are resonating in my mind. This device, its noises are resonating in my mind. That's one. Looking very hard.
It's the wrong way. Ah. <sighs> Can't interact with that anymore. I talked to him all I could. I take a thing from here. I open this. Open the other one. Plug it. I was stuck for a second there. Um, are you sure that's not later on, James? Right now, I need I need the lever, or I need like the handle for the elevator. Is what I need, or I think is what I need. Oh, Mikosa. Okie dokie, no help. I don't know what happened to that lever I had. Checked all these fucking rooms. I, mean, I fucking fully explored best I could in the living area. The rest of it's locked. condition in the disturbed air seems to prevent communication. You're all that shit. Did the Morse code. Went outside. back I don't know if you're like you're you're gone your 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 stuff did not help me at all nothing worked yeah I got the walkie-talkie light and stuff Walk and talk. I did. Okay. Maybe I didn't turn on the light good enough. I can't. I, can't. I did it in a different room. Is there a light in here I gotta turn on, I guess. Light. This room? This room? There's another fucking Voynich manuscript page. God damn it. Walkie talk. This is Frank Gilman from the Upuat Antarctic Expedition. I need to use the walkie talkie. Over. Not gonna do anything. <laughs> I can't interact with it, as you can see. I go to interact with this thing, this it's device. like, oh, this device will go over my mind. Resonating in my mind. This device, its noise well, resonating in my mind. Shamanism? Oh boy. Hmm. 
Is there anything? Does it look just scan for elevators? Like control, like control F for elevators or something. That's my current problem. Okay, so, okay, you use, I had the key, you use the item, it's gone out of your inventory. Alright, so I, I used. Well, just scan for elevator. <laughs> Look for it. <laughs> Look for it saying elevator. All I want to know is get to, like, the next area, then I'll take control. <gasps> Dang it. Boy, somebody would have found me the way over all my safe. Oh. Next to the way machine. Locked. Locked. Mash my shit out on it. What? It's locked. I can't use my hand anymore. Adjacent to. Locked. All these are just hmm, Did locked. Lock my door. I don't remember where my keys are. This room. Is there another wave machine? Boy, Harry, am I confused? This is good television. This is good. This is how you get Twitch partner right here. Probably how to get to the elevator. Is it right here? It's right here. Look for link elevator or something like that, or lever, or handle. Tower, base, cavern entrance. Maybe I gotta leave. Maybe I gotta kill myself. Use my hand anymore. Oh, you do, oh boy. Now I can use my hand again. 
Hands going bananas for that room. Some serious old gods going on in there. Having a fucking ancient one party. microphone in it the yeah it didn't work uh the let me go to it this place is super confusing by the way it's hard to, hard to navigate this room yeah let's see uh Some what about it in the oh seems to prevent communication I interact with that because there's another one of those somewhere. I can't. I did everything in here. Is there more bullshit in here? <gasps> God damn it. I had a crouch. Look. On a Hansen's note. For a while, my nights have been plagued by bizarre nightmares. Wherein I have been taken been taken to a on um, Unsubstantial figure. When I wake up every morning, I fail to remember either his visage or contents of the dialogue. Only a silhouette. Talking in a somber tone. There's night these nightmares keep me from sleeping comfortably and the kind of sleep I'm longing for. I haven't mentioned to anybody yet, but feeling a constant urge to do is but my well being is in the balance. The most logical to consult Doctor DeWitt. About this. See, I fucking. I looked at these before. They didn't trigger. The fuck is that? Okay, that was nothing then. That didn't help me. All I found was a secret. It was a secret. How secret that note was. Oh my, I feel special. Let me use this, this in is here. Frank Gilman. Can anybody hear me? Over. All right. No answer. In a cafeteria, I did. I don't remember I got anything from it. That was a while ago. Cafeterias. This way? Stuck. I can find a damn place. I remember where it was. I still don't remember. I don't. I don't really want to remember where it was. It's stuck. It needs stuck doors. Oh, here it is. Yeah. Do some hardcore scanning. Openings. Sometimes they want. Are oh. Fucking bags. Who the fucking bags? Herbal tea. Sugar. Hmm. Every fucking door it's in this stopped. game is locked. Alright, cafeteria was. thing on the ground 
Yes, I did. I remember where it's at. It, I didn't have a thing to like use it. It was like, I can't use this phonograph or whatever. Fuck it is. I was like, no, I don't say. I'm so like, I don't. Or what's it? Was it in one? I think it was. Fuck is that? Weird. Man. Bad at video games. You're bad at life, nerd. Shut up. I found a key. It wasn't on a corpse. I don't know what fucking corpse you're talking. I haven't found no body. I found a key in a drawer. Oh, can I open these? She have I opened these before? Oh, a compass. Cool. Okay, that was useless. That did nothing for me. Gold on. Oh. that phonograph thing open the thing in the middle of the cat room why no I didn't I don't think it no I don't think I did Let me go there. No, it's openable. Oh, I had a lever. Oh, there. Oh, wow. I put it in there and I never turned. Wow. Hello, weird plant. Oh, God. It's going to eat me. That's what I used the lever on. I had the lever. Oh, jeez. I'm all fucked up now. You can't help me. What does that accomplish? I'm just fucked up now. Oh, there it is. Ooh. 
what the heck? Okie doke. Now it's got a bit spooky. Oh! Is that you, Cthulhu? Okay. Alright, I'm leaving. I'll see you later. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh, it's auto. Wait. I'm sorry. Hey, buddy. Who is this? It's impossible to determine with so much decomposition. And so little polygons. Woo! I found a key. Oh, I found a note I can't fucking read. An anonymous note. We have finally finished excavating the monolith that was silently waiting for a soul to see it again. Situated within the circular building, we reached the link elevator. A magnificent piece of carving was buried halfway down under a mound of debris, and most probably could have been written in the earliest pages of history. I cannot describe exactly my feelings for the first time when I stood ag against, ag aghast it, <laughs> contemplating the gigantic stone walk inside these time-worn holes of silence. Only God knows how many ages have passed since the initial carvings. I was thinking about it, age since shivers down my spine. What civilization could have constructed such a grandeur, now waving a forlorn goodbye without giving away the secrets of his masters? Furthermore, even though most of them are damaged beyond repair, we spotted some symbols resembling the rock art of the Sahara Desert in southeast Algeria. We don't have any strong evidence suggesting anything. But Cornell Blake clings mostly to the continental drift theory. In any case, we don't have enough data on its age, but it's evident that history needs to be written yet again. Skyrim. <laughs> One of the three Skyrim. Uh, do you know I work at Bethesda? Why, um, I'm so pro Bethesda. Who is this? It's impossible to determine with so much decomposition. Oh boy. Oh, not. It's just the Cthulhu again. That one picture. Has, what's that painting called? There are things that cannot be undone. I think you should retire to your room. I, I am going to think a bit more. This is a really famous painting. It's in a lot of games. It's in a lot of stuff actually. I can't remember the name of it. Damn it, what's his name? No, it's not like, I don't think it's that. <laughs> Damn it, that's gonna bother me. I might remember that name, that painting. Yeah, Kronos. It's Kronos. Or whatever. It's Kronos feeds him on his thing. Kronos. Oh, there's some bullshit right there. 
nova et in grata vencere orbis descriptio. Saturn. I thought it was Cronus. Cronus sounds Cronus sounds the, the right. That that when when I read Cronus, that sounds. Cronus did love eating his babies. If you know about Cronus, he loved eating his children. This is his favorite thing. Here's more Voynich manuscript ripoff shit. I don't think that's in the Voynich. I think that's their own like, little ripoff thing. That's from the Voynich manuscript. <laughs> or no, it's not. Wait. I don't think it. No, it's not. Mother boy. Requiesta de Campache. Requiesta de Campache. Painting club actually depicts Kronos. Mm -hmm. This is some bullshit. Antarctica, the southernmost continent, and the site of the South Pole is virtually uninhibited, ice covered landmass. Most cruises to the continent visit the Antarctic Peninsula, which stretches towards South America. It is known for the La Mer Ch Channel and Paradise Harbor, striking icebergs, flank passageways, and Port Lockroy, a former British research station turned museum. Peninsula's isolated terrain also shelters rich wildlife, including many penguins. The rest of the text is knowledgeable. Argatha. Some markings of the Atlantic. Antarctic man. Argatha's like the under, like, the, like the land of the lost, like fucking, uh, what is it, the hollow earth shit. Argatha's like the, the, hollow earth, like the, uh, what's that fucking, World and under in the, the I'm trying to think of the word the fucking journey to center or shit. A painting's nuts though. A painting's in every horror game. Like it's nuts. No, but uh, Argatha. Google fucking Google Argatha. And you'll fucking see all the bullshit that comes up. Unless I'm unless I'm thinking of something else. I'm pretty sure that's it though. Man, this dude. This is a this is a office right here. You got this fucking bullshit on the fucking things. You got the fucking map painting there. You got skulls on your fucking shelves. This is a fucking office. Yeah, the Earth's core. Be the Hollow Earth is popular subject. Yeah, it's a Hollow Earth theory. Yeah, there's there's an old DOS or I feel like it's like a Windows three game or whatever based on it. Two. And if you try to find that game, all you do is end up finding crazy conspiracy theorist websites. And you don't want to go on there. Yeah, no. Don't that argue with this shit's stupid. Don't 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 waste your time. It's a skull. There's another, that's the, there's another famous painting. The demon on the lady's chest. That's the, that's what people used to think sleep paralysis was. Was like uh, like a demon or whatever would be like would get on top of you while you're sleeping so you would so you couldn't move. Oh shit! How can they course a whole shit? Checkmate, atheist. <laughs> and having suffered suffered from a lot of sleep paralysis, I can tell you, I am not surprised they thought that's what that was. <laughs> The paralysis fucking blows. Some creaky ass floors. There's some bullshit in that room. All this place is like full of famous paintings. They're they're just got all the fucking the 
the fuck I can't think of the word the they don't have to pay to depict these paintings because they're well. super all <laughs> it's super well known Royalty free? Yeah, I don't, that's not, that's also a word, but I think there's another word for it. It's not quite royalty free. It's like, uh oh. Oh. Public domain. Public domain is what I was looking for, Jane. I got attacked by the Leafs. <laughs> Neat. Pronunciation of Zizis. <laughs> Zizis. Oh, uh, I wanted to read it. Ooh, I want a game like Morrowind, but it's all like Lovecrafty and like bullshit. Like, I want Bloodborne theme, but like Elder Scrolls gameplay. <laughs> Elder Scrolls, like, World Exploration and stuff. You don't like horses. But what did that accomplish? Like, what did that do? I just went and... They're fu- They're- Devase. Devase? Devasa. Devasa. <laughs> Bad test horror mods. Oh, I know- I know next showcase's theme. You should love Fallen Third World. Legendary drink, the oldest myths. I heard about the elusive mixture decades ago when I was writing my thesis on Salvia Divin Divinorum, also known as Sage of the Diviners. And Antho Entheogenic. G G is that an in? Genic <laughs> plant. Used mostly in religious or shamanic. Shaman. Ceremonies. I can read. Stream dead cells. No, it's okay. I hate that game now. For centuries, no one could gather any information about it other than its legendary mystical psychoactive properties. In some sources, it was a drink of the gods, while in others, a key for opening gates to places that lie beyond the conventional human senses. A soul bridge to the past be passed in order to leave the bodily restrictions of the flesh. Most scholars would kill even for a hint one of its lost ingredients. That's something I was on the lookout for throughout my career. A new formula is forming in my mind. I feel like there's a chance for me to produce, if not the original, but a variant legendary mixture. The Versa. The, uh, the Versa. With the new clues I have uncovered during my work here. What is that? The goop. Some weird shit. In Antarctica, scientific historical timeline among occupied continents. Brown University, 1892. Oh boy, my book's a bit out of date. I want to do some 1800s fucking Antarctica exploring. No, I don't. That sounds like awful time. That sounds like a horrible. I'm gonna have Voynich manuscript. They just straight up like took the fucking JPEGs or PNGs off of. That looks like a wiener. <laughs> took those off of Wikipedia or some shit. Now, what is this room? Who is this? It's impossible to determine with so much decomposition. Yes, these are the pre-human species we found frozen in a cave far south of the base. Oh, Star Trek tonight. Oh boy. 
Oh boy. Oh, yes. Huh. These are the pre-human species we found frozen in a cave far south of the base. Some fucking squid bullshit. Oh, I did all that cool stuff, but like, I don't... Like... I really, I, I really, I made no progress. Unless I got some... Stuck. Right. Oh shit. I don't know if you can hear me, but I am trying to search it. This is the only way. Can you hear me? Damn it. Who was he? Looks like I need something to get this elevator to work. soon. He's the good shit right here. I'm liking this. This is not bad. Wish I wasn't, wish I wasn't so dumb or lost. I kind of just want to progress and see what happens. All right, time to wander around and do nothing again. Yay. Maybe the, maybe the storm's clearing up. Okay. You know, making my name and like keeping the D, B, and K capitalized. Like I never even like it never even hit me that like or crossed my mind that I would people would would call me D, B, K. I actually, I actually didn't start till Twitch. People weren't, didn't, nobody called me DBK till Twitch. Most people would like just said Dragon or Dragonborn for short. Then, then, I don't know who started. I think Yams was the first one to call me DBK. Yeah, Dragonborn King is too long to type, but it is a long name. I tried to change my Twitch name to DBK. I don't remember when but it, it was are. too short. It needs to be four letters or more, or four characters or more. Like, there's no way. Don't call me by my gay name. It's private. Condition in the disturbed air seems to prevent communication. Ah, uh, I'm getting shit. What did that say? Oh, God, we got a cipher Morse code. That it would be super epic if you call it calling me Dragonborn. Call me Delva Kane. We got it. Okay. Okay, fuck. <laughs> Do you want no Morse code? You're doing it too fast. Slow down. Oh, what is this?
Ow. This is very painful to my right ear. Oh, don't you guys fucking love Ham Radio Simulator 2017? <laughs> I do. Maybe the Morse code is telling me. Morse code, come back. An electrical condition in the disturbed air seems to prevent communication. I don't hear the Morse code anymore. I couldn't interact with this before. Damn it, the Morse code. Oh, I don't know how to work this shit. I broke it. Oh shit! That's strange. I can I do the emergency message that was originally I'm a secret. That's real. It's really loud. That's hurting my ears. Okay, I'm gonna leave this room. It's very loud and I can't turn it down. That was just a secret. Alright, I was glad I wasted my time with that. That's cool. I'm glad I wasted my time. It's noises resonating in my mind. Love wasting my time for useless secrets. Make me really happy. Get real. Wait a. S I'm retarded. Maybe it's cleared up outside. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't beating this game tonight. That ain't happening. Okay, that's not cleared up. I got some carrot cake in the kitchen. I want it. I want to eat it. I want to put it in my mouth, but I gotta wait. Can't put it in my mouth right now. progress here maybe the maybe the robot thing or whatever will talk to me again maybe he has new things to tell me wake up buddy He is the Grand Mastermind, and the pioneer of this expedition. You have nothing new. He was a secret too. Alright, Grash, back to the video. <laughs> I'm fucking lost. Yes. The answer to your question is yes.
<sighs> I have this. If this room is useless, then it lowers my frame rate. Kidder, kidder to gone. Yeah, I'm super lost. All we, all that stuff we just did was like it's stuck. And I wasn't. Nothing. Like it, it, I did make progress, I guess, but I don't. I'm just super lost. I like that would like to make more progress outside of this fucking this fucking base. Or to like the, I wanna go in the lower caverns they're talking about. I wanna go fucking I wanna go to the fucking Mountains of Madness and the fucking ancient city. Super loud. Very loud. I don't know. Uh, what am I missing? Did I lock my door? Did I, I lock my, my door? Oh no. It's locked. I don't fucking I'm lost. Yeah, I don't know what to do. Went everywhere, fucked with everything. I think. I missed something stupid again. I did before. Maybe, maybe I do gotta explore back outside. Maybe something will happen now. Trigger. 
something new. Things happen. Stuff. It's not safe to go further away from the expedition base in this weather. And go that way. Fucking no. Uh, go up here. I feel like sprinting does nothing in this fucking. key HP Lovecraft at the oh. <laughs> now we'll name the mountains written by HP Lovecraft fucking this fucking game Great book explorers from the cryptic mess, either apparent or lying hidden in the long history of the planet. For all its history is in the myth. That's it. Little Easter egg. God damn it. Motherfucker. Anybody got any clues, wink, wink, or hints, wink, 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 wink. Real helpful. So I can fucking make progress. It's not doing Morse code anymore. Like it's, I can't remember that shit. Might be, but I don't know how it's gonna fucking. That Morse code just might have been like what that guy was saying, and I just deciphered it with the radio thing or whatever. That was the secret. I just used the key. I used the key on the locked door in the generator room, and it got this stupid fucking book. That's all that key was for. Because if you use a key, I'll show you. Because if, if you use an item on something, it's gone from your inventory. The key's gone. I used it. Could the key use it on that door? It's gone. That's all it was for. It's for that little secret. Like, huh, huh, look at the book we're based off of. Huh, huh, huh. Diggity, diggity.
get stuck. Big dick. Get stuck. It won't open. That'd be ridiculous, them wanting you to fucking... I doubt, like, deciphering that Morse code. Well, it's not playing anymore. I don't know what to fucking do. That's one thing, like... I don't know what to fucking do if it's not fucking playing anymore. Oh, boy. Somewhat humanoid in form, these sculptures initially reminded us of the Terracotta Army. Sculptures carved as a finery, funerary art. Buried with the first emperor of China to protect him in the afterlife. Alright, well, let me read this. But judging by the writing on the, some of the... The boss reliefs, now I believe that the wooden puppets are... Or golems were used to carry out some tasks for their masters. Just like Egyptians. Ushabitui. Ushabitui. Funerary figurines, which are the servants of their owners hereafter. We saw the golems in several sizes. It was terrifying to see the huge ones sitting in silence on the carved and polished rock stools that they're waiting for a command. These are... There are lots of gateways lo leading to dark and damp corridors. I want to go here. I'm talking about it. Take me here. Leading to dark and damp corridors that were mostly carved ages past. Some of them were covered by strange ivy-like plants swaying back and forth despite there being no external force to move them and they seemed to come from the levels below, creeping through crevices in the rock walls. To stop probable superstitious gossip amongst the crew, Dr. Barlow, our botany expert, personally started to examine them. First sub submarine exploration revealed was lying in the underwater caves. The most striking features were the structures with openings in them, like doors and windows. It made us wonder whether these caverns had been carved underwater or if they had disemerged at least at a later date and had become redundant in those who had carved them. Like, I wanna... Like, hey, look at all this cool, like, underworld shit. Now go explore this fucking boring-ass base. What they're doing. I'll go look for fucking keys in a in a base and in generic science building. I need a photograph Was, in isn't this stuff cool? Oh, it's cool stuff you don't get to experience. Maybe you will. Maybe you gotta keep exploring science base. Are you still there? Do you still have that video, Brush? It's stuck. It's stuck. It's open. It's stuck. Alright, let's go to the fucking Morse code room. We know the Morse code's not fucking going. Alright. In the meantime, I will go to the Morse code room. code is no longer playing what was the last thing I did I got I got on a radio conversation with a dude or whatever like I like I didn't really like a guy like I was going towards the elevator that I can't go up 
and it was like I got someone going like, hey, is there anyone there on the walkie-talkie? That was like the last like story thing I did. It's not It's like, you see, from the, I can't, I can't interact with this anymore or turn it off. And you're saying it's the M, they're saying Mayday, Mayday, maybe, I don't know. It also has bullshit like this in the walls. Like anymore it's not yeah it probably was just made a Yeah, I, I did that. Yeah, that was that was like the last big thing I did. I did that, and then I did the radio thing. But that I guess the last thing, like last really big thing I did was do that. Come out of the path. Shit. And I came out of here. Another lever. No, I never found another lever. No, I did not. That's what I'm looking for. I have not found it. Probably gonna be in some place super obvious. I'm gonna feel like a giant idiot. And I ran over here and it was like I got it's like a radio I got like a thing on the walkie talkie. stuff okay ever's on a shelf in a room with some maps well <laughs> about every room in this game has maps but maybe it's in this room because this was like the unlocked room if it was in a room I've been in a million times and missed it I'm gonna be so fucking I'm gonna be so mad Oh, God damn it. <laughs> I missed it. Oh, my God. But also, every room in this game has fucking maps on the fucking wall. Like, look at that shit. I can't believe I missed that. It's hard. I blame streaming. I 
Goblin Street. It distracts me, okay. <laughs> Oh yes, give me the crazy sh yes, give me the crazy shit. Give me the ancient stuff. Give me some, oh yes, yes! Anyone here? Yes, this is what I wanted. Dr. James? Dr. Morgan? Dreaming does lower, Anybody? that's a proven fact. Yes. Where are Thank they for you. God's sake? This is what I wanted, oh it's great. Look at this bullshit. Look at this fucking beam. Dang it. Let me explore the cool stuff, game. Oh, here we go. Perfect. There's some strange vegetation filling most of the hallways. As amazing as it's deadly, there's a hidden world right beneath the base. Blah, 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 base. Even though I was prepared to find such a place, it was way different than, imagine, than I imagined alone. We tried to cut our way through it with a plant ran with a highly poisonous gas, seemingly covering its glowing buds. I issued a warning to stop anyone going near these plants they came across any of those caverns. Well, some of a strange phenomenon after I spent some time examining a sample from the plant. It occurred to me that the visuals, individual veins grow and shrink in length, length on demand. All seems as though it can move, even though there are no air currents. This movement seems too regular to be caused by natural factors. This may sound strange, but I have the notion that it is cautious, at least at some level. Conscious. Neat. Wait. Oh, yeah. Get it now. Get it. Ah. Oh. Oh, it's making me bug out. The way ahead is blocked by this curious vegetation. Maybe we should save. That made my TV's fucking input like clock thing come on when I died. It made it made that was weird. Like my little TV like clock and like setting thing pop up. Hey, don't fuck with that. Bitch, I got next. Never I got next. Think of what you know. I got next. Alright, so I guess I gotta go to the top of the base or something. I was like in the center part. So I can go up or down. I can go down. I can go down again. Oh, yeah. We going, boy. Oh. There's no more down. Dang it. 
Cream is what the hell happened? What the hell did the game do? Oh, what the fuck? It reset it to fucking full screen. That's fucking weird. I didn't realize that. Thank you, Sim. Dying reset my game to full screen. Gotta go up again. <laughs> Not told him that. That would be me. Whoa. Ooh, up's cooler than down. Oh, shit. Game's getting cool now. I don't want to quit. Oh. That's some bullshit. Oh, it's chromatic <gasps> aberration. Ah. Oh, is that you, Cthulhu? Dagon? Who is it? Hey, this oh. is amazing. Most of the ground level structures have been crumbled and rounded from untold eons of savage storms, and thus weathered into shapeless ruins. However, both the ground level and the cavern systems below are clearly displayed in these bas reliefs. I probably would have noticed the though, most striking bit. features depicted in this grand panorama, I believe, are the tall, occasional towering spires, which somehow resemble a lighthouse. They all seem like focusing a light beam towards a colossal structure in the center. Hmm. Could there be some sort of religious meaning behind this? Or simply something that has a more practical use? Oh, that Call of Cthulhu game coming out this year is not garbage. Not garbage, yo. So, this is the strong life. <laughs> Can be seen from ground level. So this is the strong life. Okay, can't go any further. From ground level. All right. Some some fucking crazy bullshit carvings. Picked up this thing. Don't know where that could go into. There's a pyramid. Ancient aliens bullshit. Can I go up again? Not. Base cover entrance. I don't know what I'm going to use this thing for. Maybe something down at the bottom.
Oh, back to being lost. cylinder hmm what do I use this bullshit key for oh yes these are the pre-human species we found frozen in a cave far south of the base Where that going to? Who did you fit into? Anything that looks like it, that could fit into. Oh boy. This thing, maybe? This device. Its noises are resonating in my mind. Man, I don't fucking know. I'm super lost again. Might have been something at the top. I don't think it's anything down here. You didn't miss anything. I have I have this thing and I don't know what it goes to. I'm looking for it. It's probably back up the fucking elevators and shit. I co stream E3 tomorrow. If I get three yeses, then maybe I will. No, okay. <laughs> One no. One meh. Alright, not looking promising. Or 
It has to be. It looks it looks fucking weird and old, so it has to be something. That's like either bottom or top level. That's the only place that had weird crazy shit. Better level I found it in. Let me skip. And no one I met. Become an old public domain horror movie. Well, that's what the that's what the the movie night is. But I think I'm gonna take. I don't. I'm. I'm still working out movie night. I'm not sure how I want to do it. Like it's still it's still in the planning processes. What are these bullshit things? What do I do with you? What do you want? Thulu, help me. Thulu, what do I do? Do I smack it with an axe? There's a lot of stuff. There, I, I have movies for movie night. That would be fun, but I'm not. I'm not sure how I want to do it yet. Okay. Can I skip these anymore? Did, did I abuse it too much? Does the game not want me to do it anymore? Now I can skip it again. Fucking video games. Hey, oh, yeah, that's. Help me, hand. Oh. I'm feeling you are right, Simon. Things are easy to miss in game. Or I'm blind. Either or. Oh yeah, now it's getting good. Right as it's coming to stream in time. Oh, we got some fucked up bugs. And I got here. We got some crazy plants. Some carvings. There's some bullshit happening. Oh, this is great. This is what I wanted. This is awesome. Please get grosser. Maybe. Stuff really doesn't stand out. Oh, yes. Please. I just got to flip turn upside down right there. There's more quest markers. We got some sacrificial altars. Oh yes, yeah, my ship. That's where you party. This is where you party right here. Up. Oh. Shit's happening. Going nuts. What 
was that I've just seen? I don't know. Ooh. Carvings aren't aren't crazy enough to me. They need to be a little more, a little more bananas. I don't know what those are. Five pieces of stone with different glyphs on them. Neat. Those six tile makes it, nothing really stands out. And that's why so many games have cheap, like detective mode, and just make it bored. Yeah. Detective mode shit's usually for more AAA games, more like games that are gonna be much more played by like more casual people. Like most people aren't gonna play this game. Okay, stop. I'm scared. I need the Witcher senses. I need to be Batman. See Batman Batman's not scared of Cthulhu. Batman punched Cthulhu in the face. Batman with prep time. Dude, don't stand a chance. This is cool. This is getting cool now. I like it. This is getting really cool now. I don't want to quit. This keeps happening in this game where I'm like, ah, oh, fuck, get tired. I need to quit. Then I found, like, then I get the cool shit again. Oh. Oh, they're crazy. Those are people. Uh oh. Is that you, Jesus? Now to get closer. Hmm. If I am not mistaken, this relief depicts that the overgrown floor we came across at the various points in the cavern uh, can be cleared away with an <sighs> iridescent device, a tool or a talisman. Curiously, we still haven't been able to find the roots of those plants. They seem to seep out of these caverns by passing through crevices which look as if intentionally made for them. <laughs> what other right, these guys are might fucking these silent players conceal from us? These guys know how to party, look at them. That guy. I have wieners though. Early party with a wiener. Another axe. Maybe, maybe that's, you've missed the first one. I should probably stop while this game's interesting. Oh boy. What insane discoveries we made in a short period of time. Even proof Professor William Dyer's shocking revelation is not enough to prepare us for this. Seeing is really relief. Believing is really believing. Those discoveries also cause uproar. Up uproar amongst the crew members whose assumptions indicate the fate of the expedition will end in ruin. Some serious mental disorders are prime focus right now. It's a pretty solution. We probably the area of the rest of the members that seem the most ready to accommodate such a thing. Reflecting the flooded halls ahead of our basic diving equipment, we concluded that we would be a better divide in our exploration team and to do more to carry out an explanation more effectively. According to the latest plan, we always send off two teams with submarines and two where they exist to continue in the depths of the submarine channel the rest of the beings were to land. Dr. Morgan, let's take clack, clack, up. Yeah. HP Lovecraft, love him some lizard people. through this gateway. Other expedition parties can commence when ready. And? Oh. Oh, this is a Stargate? Oh, boy. We throwing Stargates in here? I 
All right. I think I think now is a good stopping point, but I don't want to stop. Okay, I'm, I am going to play this game again. I'm not I'm definitely not done with this game. I don't know when. Maybe Sunday. I want to get back to Morrowind too. I'm not done streaming Morrowind. The character I'm doing. I'm doing some off stream like grinding and stuff with that character. And I'm gonna continue with like story with it. And I kind of prefer playing Morrowind like off stream by myself. So I don't feel like obligated to. Like I don't feel obligated to keep stuff interesting. I can just fucking be my boring old self playing the game. Good night, good night to you. How do you say good night and finish, Invent? I'm waiting so I can pronounce it horribly. Hey, oh, fuck that. <laughs> I have a Yoda. <laughs> no, it's. Don't you. Wait. Yeah, fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> That's my pronunciation. Haiva Yoda. Yuta. Yuta. I know I have no clue. Alright. Thanks for sharing that. Give me some uh, Google Translate robot pronouncing it for me. <laughs> that was fun. I got stuck a few times. I wish it didn't. I wish it didn't get stuck so much. I could have made more progress in the three hours. Would have been uh, a little preferable. All right. Good night, everybody. Thanks for watching. That was fun. Next showcase will be, I don't know. <laughs>